Hello everybody. So for today, I am going to be showing you how to make the perfect size bikini cup that will actually cup around your breast and not come out flat and so that it is a perfect fit for you. So the materials that we will be needing today is some cotton yarn. I am going to be using this Malabrigos yarn. It is 100% Pima cotton. There's 205 yards in here. It's hand wash and lay flat to dry in the color Mandarin. You do not have to use this exact yarn but that is what I will be using. I will also be using a four, or excuse me, a 3.5 millimeter crochet hook, a size E. So to make the perfect cup, as you see, here are your nipples and here's the bottom of your breast. So our beginning chain, we want to make it fit from the bottom of our breast to the middle of our nipple, is how long we want our beginning chain to be. For me, I am going to chain 13. So I will show you for my size, if you need a larger chain to fit up to your nipple, just go ahead and chain the additional stitches. I will show you what to do next. If you have not done yet, please go ahead and subscribe. My messy handwriting, subscribe to my channel. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and let's go ahead and get started with the tutorial. Okay, so to begin, I am going to do 12, or excuse me, 13 chains. This will reach from the bottom of my breast to the middle of my nipple. So I'm gonna go ahead and do one, two, three, four, five, six, oops, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, and 13. So that's how much I will need for myself. But for you, you will want to do the amount of change that chains that will reach from the bottom of your breast to the middle of your nipple. So whatever amount of chains that is for you, you will want to skip the first three stitches and we are going to double crochet into the fourth. So we're gonna skip one, two, three, and in the fourth, we are going to do one double crochet. So this is going to be the only time that a chain three will count as a stitch. So now we are going to continue to do one double crochet in each of the stitches along the chain, however many that is for you, all the way to the end. So go ahead and do that. Meet me back at the end here and I will show you how we're going to work back over to the other side. Okay, so here I am at the other end and I am going to do two double crochets in the last stitch. There's one and two. And now we are going to start working along the opposite side of our chain. So we're going to chain up one and do two more double crochets into the same space that we were just working into. So there is one and two. Okay. And now in this very next stitch, we are going to do one double crochet. And the next chain, we're going to do one double crochet all the way to the end. So on this side, if you count the chain three, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve 10, 11, 12 stitches for me. So working back down this side, I'll have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So go ahead and work all the way back to the end. I will show you what stitch to end in so we don't miss anything. Okay, so now I have 10 stitches going down this way. So I have two more spots that I need to double crochet. So I'm going to go into this chain space here 
that makes 11. And I'm gonna do my last stitch right here, right at the end, right there, okay? So let's go ahead and count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve right there. So now to continue, we're going to chain up three. From now on, this chain up three will not count as a stitch. We're going to turn our work and double crochet right back into that same space. So that's going to be our first double crochet. We're going to continue to work all the way down to the other side till we get to the chain one space. And then we're, we will work our way back around. And after that, the rows are pretty much the same. I will show you how you want to measure the width to make sure that it will be wide enough to cover your breast. So go ahead and go until you get to this chain one space. Uh, so crochet all the way up these double crochets and I'll meet you back at this video. Here I am at my last stitch before the chain one space. When you do get to the chain one space, we are going to do two double crochets, chain up one, two double crochets all into the same space. So let's go ahead and do that together. Here is one double crochet. We're going to do two double crochet, chain one, and then we're gonna put two more double crochets into that same stitch. So there is one and two. Okay, so that is our increase. So now we are just going to double crochet into the stitch right next to where we are at. And we're just going to continue to work our way back across to the end. So we are not going to double crochet into the chain three space at the very end. We are going to end at the stitch right here. So go ahead and do that and I will be back here for one more row and we will continue this. This is going to grow our cup this way and wide. So for me, seven rows is what works to fit around my cup or around my breast all the way. So go ahead, work your way back to the end of the row. I'll chain up with you go back around and we will go ahead and measure to make sure that it is large enough. Okay, so here I am at my last stitch. We are not gonna go into the chain three. So now we're gonna chain up three, one, two, and three. We will turn our work, double crochet back into that same space. And we will work all the way back up to the chain one. I will show you how to do that again. Okay, so here I am at the chain one space again. We're going to do two double crochets in the chain one space. Chain up one and do two more double crochets into that same space. And then we are going to continue to work in the stitch right next to that and all the way down. To make sure that you are doing your work and not missing stitches or doing too many, make sure to count and make sure that you have even amount of stitches on either side of your chain one space. As you continue to work, you will build up your, your cup size to fit the rest of your breast and it will be going out as well. So each row that you're doing, you're making it get wider as well as taller. So when we first started, we measured from our nipple down to our breast or from the bottom of our breast to our nipple. And that was just a single chain. So as we work our rows, they're going to get wider. And so you wanna do as many rows as it takes to cover 
from one side of your breast to the other. Okay, so as we're working back and forth, you know, uh, this way, up and down and up and down, it's building it out wider and taller. So for me, this is seven rows. I'm gonna go ahead and work seven rows, and then I will meet you back here to show you my trick to really get your uh, bikini cup to make that cup, to make it round. Okay, so I have made my seven rows. As you see here, it's fairly cupped already, but I really like to make sure that I have a nice round bit to my cup. So I'm going to chain up one and turn my work. I'm going to do one double crochet or single crochet over the previous double crochet. And I'm just going to do single crochet all the way across my cup. And go ahead and do that when you meet me back at the chain one space. I will show you how we're going to do that. Now I'm at my chain one space and we're just going to do like we did with the double crochets. We're going to do two single crochets, chain up one, two single crochets. If you would like to make a strap at this point, you could. And then I'm just going to single crochet my way back to the other side. When we get there, we will do the bottom of the cup and that will help to kind of bring that in tighter. So as you see that single crochet just really closes up the cup. So go ahead and work to the other side and I will show you how to close up the bottom. Okay, so once I have single crocheted up both of my sides, you see it really gives it that nice cup. So now we're going to work along the bottom. This will help close it up a little bit more. So we have the height and the width that fit us. And now doing this is just gonna make sure that it's really, really snug around our breasts. So now we're gonna chain up three and we are going to double crochet into the first double crochet right here, just right into that space. And we're going to double crochet across the chain threes and the double crochets all the way across the bottom. So as you see, we now have our top, the point down, and we're going to be working along the bottom part. So just go ahead and do a double crochet all the way across. And this is pretty much it, you guys. This is all you need to do to make the perfect fitting bikini cup. And we'll work this all the way to the end with you. Okay, so here I am at the end and I will just do a double crochet or single crochet into that first single crochet. Now, if I were to have a second cup made, I would then attach the two. I will have a tutorial on how to make a full bikini on my page, but that is how you make the perfect fitting cup. You would then, you know, you can trim this and fasten off. And there you go, you have a perfect bikini top. Please make sure to like this video and leave me a comment on what you guys think. And please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you get notified when I release new tutorials.